Shingen Buddhism, also known as Shingenshu, is a form of Japanese Vajrayana Buddhism that is known for its unique approach to spiritual practice. Unlike other forms of Buddhism, Shingen places a strong emphasis on experiencing the ultimate reality, known as the Dharmakaya. This emphasis is achieved through the use of synchronized meditative rituals, which are designed to help practitioners connect with the essence of the ultimate reality and achieve a deeper understanding of the universe. One of the key elements of Shingen Buddhism is the use of mantras, which are sacred sounds, words, or phrases that are repeated during meditation. These mantras are believed to have the power to transform the mind and lead the practitioner to a state of enlightenment. In Shingen, the recitation of mantras is considered to be a powerful tool for connecting with the ultimate reality and experiencing its true nature. In addition to the use of mantras, Shingen Buddhism also incorporates the use of madras, which are symbolic hand gestures that are used to evoke particular ideas or feelings. The use of madras in Shingen practice is intended to help practitioners experience the inner realization of the Dharmakaya and to express their understanding of the ultimate reality through physical movements. Another important aspect of Shingen Buddhism is the visualization of mandalas, which are intricate geometric designs that represent the cosmos. Practitioners are taught to visualize these mandalas during meditation as a way to connect with the universe and gain insight into the nature of reality. The use of mandalas in Shingen practice is a powerful method for deepening one's understanding of the ultimate reality. Overall, Shingen Buddhism is known for its unique approach to spiritual practice, which emphasizes the use of synchronized meditative rituals to connect with the ultimate reality. Through the use of mantras, madras, and visualization of mandalas, practitioners are able to deepen their understanding of the universe and experience the true nature of the Dharmakaya.